Gen4 Olive is an innovative project with the goal to make the most of the genetic diversity of olive trees and help improve olive farming. Olive production faces challenges like the global climate crisis and new diseases. There's a risk of losing olive varieties because most of them aren't used for commercial purposes. This happens mostly because we haven't fully explored the genetic diversity of olive trees due to a lack of collaboration between those who store these genetic resources and those who grow and improve olive trees. Gen 4 Olive focuses on making olive trees more resistant to the impacts of global heating, pests, and diseases, while boosting their productivity and adapting them to modern farming methods. This project involves various groups like gene banks, small and medium-sized businesses, agricultural experts, technology providers, academics, consumers, government bodies, and the public. Within this framework, the Fee for Olive sub-project, a joint effort by Commons Lab and Spectral Tech, has created a system to help evaluate olive trees' performance in pre-breeding activities. This system focuses on monitoring the chemical makeup of olive leaves in order to assess how new olive tree varieties are performing. The core of the system relies on the multispectral camera developed by Spectral Tech, combined with the IoT sensor monitoring platform of Commons Lab. This allows for the evaluation of the olive tree's health and for a more accurate assessment of their chemical properties while they're still growing. To make sure the digital solutions work as intended, they were tested in a real-world scenario using standard pre-breeding conditions in the tree nursery of Pungalo's Green Gardens. In this setting, the system provides a comprehensive range of health and stress indicators for evaluating the olive trees, especially regarding the challenges they face from their environment, while the IoT sensors collect data throughout the pre-breeding process to have continuous information about their environmental conditions. Using this method and machine learning, trained with just a few hundred samples, the system was able to predict for more than 80% of the plants, which ones grow healthy roots and which don't. This information helps to save time and space in the greenhouse.